So, what are you afraid of? I'm afraid of taking on the name and losing. Don't call me a fraud. Fake creed. What you think about what's true? You love to fight, right? Yeah, it makes you happy, right? Yeah. Yeah, and you are Apollo Creed's son, right? Yes. So then use the name. It's yours. This is taken from the 10th round of the first fight, right? Good call. How'd you know that? I heard about a third fight between you and Apollo. Behind closed doors. That true? How'd you hear about that? Who won? It's kind of a secret. What'd you say your name was? I'm done. Okay. Well, so the girl said you wanted to talk about something? Yeah, I want to talk to you about training me. Training. <laughs> I don't do that stuff no more. Sorry about that. Listen, it's getting kind of late, kid, so I'm going to uh, close up. How good was he? Apollo, yeah, he was great. He's a perfect fighter. Ain't nobody ever better. So how'd you beat him? Time beat him. Time, you know, takes everybody out. It's undefeated. Anyway, I got a lot. So when up. Mickey died, he came and talked to you, right? Talked you out of quitting. Took you to L.A. Trained you. Brought you back. How do you know all this? How do you think? What are you, like a cousin? He's my father. I mean, what I look like, letting you train me while you sit around and die. Just like any other fight. This fight? I've seen it before. It gets as bad as it can get. And most of the time, you don't win it. You know, but I don't care. I ain't training if you don't get the treatment. So if I fight, you fight. It's okay. It's okay. Deep breath. Bring it on. Deep breath. Deep breath. Look at me. I like what you're doing out there, all right? You're a little tight. You're gonna loosen up, all right? Here's what I want you to do. I want you to throw your left under the radar. Yes, then when you come up with a shovel hook, you're gonna see an opening, put it right on his chin, then I'll drop him. I'll be... Mouthpiece piece in, seconds out! Your old man did that to me. It worked. Mouthpiece piece in, seconds out! Go finish it out, yo! Everything I got is moved on, and I'm here. But you know what? It's OK. Because I said to myself, if I break, if I'm hurt, whatever, I ain't going to fix it. Why bother? And I'm just some bum that's living in your crib, just, just nothing. You're a good kid and a good fighter. But you got your whole future ahead of you, mine? Back there, like all them guys on that wall in the back, in the past. Where'd you get this? Mexico? It's not that bad. It's not that bad. I ought to knock you out myself. You know how many times I had to carry your father up these stairs because he couldn't walk? Is that what you want? No, you want brain damage. Yeah, you do. You want to be so brain damaged, you can't form a sentence. I can get hurt doing anything. Apollo didn't get hurt. He got killed. People get killed. I didn't take you in for you to go backwards. You're better than this. Well, I'm leaving soon. I'm going to be fighting full time now. So I want to tell you face to face. You are your father's son. And you're part of him. But it doesn't mean you have to be him. No, I don't even know what I'm doing here, because I, I got other plans in my life, and this wasn't part of it. Your father was special. 
Tell you the truth, I don't know if it's special. Only you're gonna know that when the time is right. And it ain't gonna come overnight. You're gonna take a beat, you're gonna take this, you're gonna get knocked down, you're gonna get up, and you're gonna see if you got the right thing. But you gotta work hard. I swear to God, if you're not gonna do it, I'm out. Like every punch I ever thrown has been on my own. Nobody showed me how to do this. I'm ready. <laughs>